Hello everyone, welcome back to Nine Ghost 49. We're playing the Mega Mod today on Toolsville. Toolsville, not the co-op series. I'm gonna go ahead and pause things. We just got six nomads. <gasps> Holy crap, we're building up this pasture over here, and I think it's time we want to look at production and kind of what we're doing and figure out if we can do things a little bit better. Because right now, as you can see, we've got some good trading going on up here. Industry supplier, wool coats, seedlings. Marble and jade statues have actually dropped off quite a bit because we had to pull away some of the, um, you know, production over here. But where is my town hall? Where where to go? I <laughs> I seem to have lost it. That is a market. That is not a town hall. I don't know if you guys knew that, but uh, you know. So we've got the all right, the immigration office right here. Now the immigration office works on this map. It wasn't working on my other one, which I was kind of bummed about. That's the general store. How on earth did I seriously lose? I I have lost my town hall. Where did it go? <laughs> oh, I I like to see metrics and things. I, I like to know what's happening. Someone bring it back. Wait, is that it? No, that's a tailor. That's an iron smelter. What the crap? Um, small town market. No, seriously. Where did I put my town hall? Am I like building it somewhere else? Should I? I should be building it over here, really. What the crap? Where did my town hall go? I guess I didn't care because of the immigration office. Maybe I don't know. What the heck? Anyway, we've got another house being built over here. Are we not on speed ten? Like seriously, can we get our can we get our game together? Can we like actually you know get stuff rocking and rolling here? Let's build a few more a few more homes, and then I'm gonna build a town hall. Because what the heck is wrong with me? I don't have one. I bet you it's somewhere, and everyone is literally like freaking out right now. I got something over here. Face palm. You're the worst. Why don't you remember things? Because brains are hard and stuff. Actually, they're quite squishy. All right, let's go over here and check on town hall business. Hmm. Small town hall. That looks familiar. It really does. Died of starvation. <sighs> No! Ah, oh, it doesn't work! It doesn't work. Alright, I'm, I'm upset now. So, the immigrate. This is what I, what I had before. The immigration office spawns in the people on the edge of the map on impassable areas. It doesn't work. Crap! Alright, well, there's that. Um, we're gonna need to, we're gonna need to deal with that a little bit. What do I, what do I have that I need to put away here? Llamas? We're gonna do more llamas? I don't know. Whatever. Let's finish off some houses. Let's get an actual town hall going so that uh, we can rock and roll on this. I've actually got quite a few laborers, which means that uh, those are children that died, which makes me sad. <laughs> um, let's see. Where are we at here? Meeting house? Meeting house? Yeah? No? Are we doing a meeting house? Um, there's the legit big old town hall. Colonial town hall. I don't have the resources for that. And, yeah. Oh, and I love, I love how people... <laughs> Uh, people were making fun of me because, uh, see, look, over here. That's where they spawned. They're all going to die over here. I don't even care. That just makes me angry. I love, love how people were like, yeah, a courthouse is like a church for people. Look, I know I didn't say that the best. Shush. <laughs> people got a pretty good laugh after, you know, I said absolutely ridiculous things. Um, okay, so I think we need to get some solid industry going and then just food like crazy but I, I need to find, oh, yes, I need to, I need to get, um, oh gosh, what was I going to say? I need to get building supplies going so I can get advanced structures. I think that's what's really going to help us out a lot more. Um, let's buy logs? Eh? No? You know what? I'm going to do, when Merchant arrives, buy, buy like 200. I'll let the ones go for here. Let's just do 200 and then 200 iron. I don't want to kill my supply entirely. Um, hit error. And yeah, yeah, we're good. Oh well, you, whatever. I'll buy them. Let's let's get in the habit, right? Seedlings. What you gonna do for me? Holy cow, that's that's good stuff. Uh, five, right? No, I am SMRT. I did the math wrong in my head. There you go. Get that guy out of here. All right, we've got enough area and land. I wonder. Let's look and see. We have enough homes. It looks like. Well, actually, I could use a couple more homes. Um, let's look at production. We're out producing on food, but not by much. So we could improve that. Tools. We look fantastic. Iron. Not so much. Um, stone, doing okay. And let's see, if we look at the food over the last like five years, we're doing fine. 
let's go back to inventory and look at quantity. So, food. I've got a lot of food. I've got a lot of logs. I've got a decent amount of clay as well. So we could start doing brick, or we could, um, let's see, brick. Or we could start doing pottery and selling pottery. Are we doing that already? I don't think we were. No. We weren't. And that's fine. Wait, how much marble and jade do I have? Marble, 57. Jade... 36. I'll just turn these both on so we can get a little bit more uh, trade goods. Rocking and rolling over here. But I think what I need to do is, uh, let's, should we split this off? I think we should split this off. Let's get somebody working this for llamas. Split. Get one person going there. We're going to lose that as a food source for a bit, but it might be a good idea to put a couple of farms over here. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get a couple farms. Go the transparent ones for now. Basically, I want to get some food going a lot more than we currently have. And I want to leave an extra gap. And then I think I'm going to do these these kind of short ones. Like maybe 6 by 16. And then we can do um, we can do a couple different foods here. Just to spice it up, make it look a little different. Kind of cool. All right, all these guys paired off. That's fantastic. Some of these did not. Uh, you. You're living by yourself, but that's okay. Way to be you. And let's see. Tools. We're good to go on tools. I think we should just up that limit to 1,000. And the same thing with clothes. Perfect. And are we doing wool? I know we're doing wool because we're selling some over here, dang it. How are we doing on overall stocks for wool and wool coats? Wool, not so great, but wool coats are looking good. That's fine. We're going to increase the wool production here. That's going to be a good trade resource for us. So I think we're going to be fine. Um, but again, I think what we could do is let's get the building supply guy up. And from there, let's see, furnace fuel. Am I not doing any furnace fuel? What? Oh, I have a million. All right, well, that's fine. Um, I think what we could do is let's get a bunch of shore houses because they're nice. And they work out quite well. Where did they go? Hello. Ceremonial ground. A small ground appearing to be some historical uh, significance. Hmm. Okay, thank you for that, I guess. No, really, where's the shore house? Got another trader. I've got some automatic purchases on there, so I don't need to like jump on that right away. Ah, here they are. They got moved around just a tiny bit. Okay, let's put in a handful of these. These are going to be fantastic for clay and for sand. What I want to do is do um, brick, and then we're also going to do sand, and we're going to get some. Um, we're going to get building supplies off of that. So digging clay, we've got plenty of clay. Let's put. Actually, let's do both of these at clay. We'll say work. I've got quite a few people because we're educating now. Look at how many kids we have. This is freaking awesome. Pretty stoked about that. Let's finish that off. Um, where is ah the deep mine? Fantastic. Oh yeah. Iron ore. Are we like overloaded on iron ore? Is that why I slowed that down? Because that seems a little crazy. <laughs> yes, that's exactly why. Wow. Awesome. All right. Um, it's early summer. Will they actually do anything? So tomato and soybeans are it. That's all we're doing. I'm gonna hold off on producing this yet until I can put a big barn over here or something. Um, I want to be able to fill that up. And make it nice and efficient. So let's put some homes over here too. And then some roads. I think for now I'm going to ease off on the on the uh, stone. And just do dirt roads for the moment. Because I don't want to run out of resources. And I'm using, I'm using the wrong roads, aren't I? I want to use the other ones. Yes. No, okay, fine, whatever. Finish, finish your dumb road. Um, no, no, grass one, right? The country road. Let's be consistent. There we go. Fantastic. There we go. And down here. Awesome. All right. What do you have here? Wool coats, you're out of wool. I'm okay with that for now. We're going to be getting a lot more wool right here um, by amping up this production even more. All right. What do we need to get going? Building supplies. Got to focus on that. Let's do a building supplier. Pro well, no, actually, I don't want to do it there. We need the clay and we need glass. So I'm thinking, wait, what do you, what do you, whoa, 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 what are you maxed on? Logs? Well, then do two, do 4,000. I want, I don't want that to be maxed. And um, let's turn off two of these, right? And then we'll just get these two working for sand. And then we're going to do building supplies over here. I don't want to mess with this area, so we're just going to build it up in this way. And then I, I'm going to pull clay and stuff down here to make bricks. Um, and then the sand to make glass. So we're going to make a little industry right on the edge here, I think, is what we're going to do. So we've got a, quite a bit of clay, I believe. Yeah, 2,000 clay. I've got plenty of furnace fuel. Um, am I making brick? No. 
but we will be. Okay, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Let's go in here, and we'll get ourselves smelting. Um, nope, wrong one. Sorry. We need the brickworks. We'll put that right here. All right. One brickworks ought to work for now. And then we also need uh, glassworks. We'll do those a little bit separated, okay? And then we'll do some stockpiles, which we will eventually uh, change. We'll change those stockpiles into <clears throat> into the, uh, the specialized stockpiles, and that'll be good. But we need building supplier over here. I'm going to use this to actually break things up a little bit. So I don't have the farms over here. You know, you guys know how it goes. You can uh, you get a lot of disease that can spread. That's where we're breaking this up over on this way. Um, that, that's my thought process right now. So let's make some roads over here so that they're nice and efficient. Very good. And I'd like to have a second barn over this direction. It doesn't need to be that huge, but I think it might be beneficial to do one of these storage barns like right there. I know I'm stacking up a lot of building projects, but you know what? We got, we got to keep going. We got to rock and roll. And uh, I think this is going to be for the best. So let's also put some materials, stockpiles. I think materials are probably going to be the best for now. Um, let's see, material stockpile, and then we'll just do a, a generic one as well. Okay, and then from here, let's get the roads going. Perfect, and then we'll go down this way. Awesome. Now we're going to start making brick. Let's get one guy there. You can start making brick, furnace fuel and clay, uh, which means I need to get my furnace fuel guy going at some point. I don't know if we're doing well on fuel. I think I'm going to be I'm going to be hitting that even harder. So I I probably want to make another brickworks, but I'll make it over here. I've got two guys working this one making charcoal. So maybe I'll make one more. Oh, I completely ignored the last the last dude that came here. You know, let's buy some charcoal just to uh, be safe. I want to I want to be safe. Carbon steel tools, yes please. I don't want to. I know we're doing perfectly fine on tools, but if we can get better ones, that's just going to let us get even more ahead. And there's nothing wrong with that. So let's get some wool coats because we're looking fine on coats. And there we go. Trade that out. I don't need brick. We're going to make those. I don't need rugs. It's fine. We can work on that. It's it's not that big a deal. So I got the little storage shed here, and we've got a little bit of stockpile going on. All right, perfect. Uh, these are now out of supply. That kind of sucks. So we're going to back off of that just a tiny bit. Do I only have one person working these? This is such a good industry that I have never really, really like dug into. And we can always pull people off of here. Let's just get more people working that right now. I think that's a good, a good solid idea. All right. Brick here. We've got clay and, uh, and bricks. Um, I do believe we can get ourselves some supply guys. Where are they? I always forget where they are. But we'll find them. Don't you worry. Oh, carts. Here we go. Fuel market cart. We will need fuel for this whole area. So let's, let's go ahead and put in the fuel market cart. It'll pull stuff that we need. We're going to make glass out of sand and furnace fuel. Okay, let's go ahead and get that going. Perfect. And then we have the building supplier over here, which will do brick and glass and iron. Hmm. You know what? I, I do want to do this, but that means we're going to have to change up the way we're doing iron. Um, I think I only have like one or two smelters, and that's not going to fly. Um, I don't think that's a, a very good idea at all. Let's turn off. Let's turn off that tailor for now. We'll. We've got the other big one. We can turn that one off for the moment. Uh, this one's smoking. It's making roast. Oh my goodness! That doesn't that sound good? Roast. Unless you're vegetarian, which is fine. That's fine. You don't need to like it either. Um. Look, Martha's not going to be this series too. Okay. Iron smelter. Look at you. Good job, you. There's three people working working the blacksmithing field. One of them is there. One of them is here. Do I have a second smelter? That's the real question. Somebody was crushed by a rock. That is unfortunate. Um, where yet? Where yet? Do I have another smelter? Or do we have another blacksmith or workshop? Let's turn this a little bit to get a different angle on things. Ah, I've lost it. I don't know where he is. Materials, charcoal. No, no, no. We need, we need that to be like the fuel limit. Um, you know what I should be doing? I should actually have the fuel limits up here somewhere. Let's let's just hide that over here for a minute. I found this to be kind of useful. You know? Kind of useful. Let's up the health limit. Like, that seems kind of silly to have that low. And where's fuel? 800? <laughs> we were beating the crap out of that. Let's put that at 1400. Basically, I need a better smelting situation. And I think uh, having a big one is going to be better. 
So, okay, here we go. Look, fuel. Let's get this guy working this so that the fuel dude can start pulling stuff over so these guys don't have to run quite as far away and they can become even more efficient. All right, look at, look at this stone. They're already starting to bring it in. I love it. I love these uh, stone shacks just uncovering stuff like a boss. All right, I do have this area. Oh, that's a crop field. Derp. Um, what do I need to smelt? I need iron, which we have iron ore here. And do we have furnace fuel over here? Furnace fuel is like right over here. I think I need to smelt in this area. Maybe we'll smelt over here. It's a little bit of a run, but I think it's going to be okay. Let's check the trader real quick. Sand, iron and stone tools, carbon steel. Um, I think I'll hold off for the moment. I bought some a minute ago. Let's let our, our stocks actually build up a little bit more. And that's the only thing that's coming right now. We really need to start getting food and uh, seeds and all that good stuff. Okay, why don't we do this? Let's go to refined resources, blacksmithing, and where's the forge? There it is. All right, listen, forge face. It's time for you to rock and roll over here. All right, maybe I'll put it a little bit closer in this area. We'll give it a tiny bit of room on one side. Actually, on both sides. I need to start doubling up my roads. Oh, I already doubled that one. Derp. I already doubled that road. And we're getting a decent amount of stone. Wait, which stone is this? This is the key, the, the keystones, right? Not sandstone. Where was it? Aha! Let's do that over here. There we go. We'll just expand that out a little bit more too. Okay, so we want to get, uh, we've got quite a bit of ore and quite a bit of furnace fuel. I think the furnace fuel is starting to go down. Yeah, it's gone down by about 300. So let's check our ore. 1300. And we have so little iron compared to that number. Like how silly is that nonsense? It's extra, super nonsense, silly. All right, let's go in here and say, whoops. Let's go in here and say, work this area, do furnace fuel so we can just stay on top of that. We could sell furnace fuel, but it's like three. It's not worth it. It's just garbage. So let's let's have this one, two, two people work in here. We can amp this up to like five, and we just want iron. We just want iron like crazy, and that's what we're going to do. All right. Um, let's turn these back on for a minute because they're gonna they're gonna need to keep working. That's the jade and the marble statues. Oh, I never actually selected these, did I? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Um, we don't have building supplies yet, so I can't upgrade this, which means let's get going on the actual building supplies. So there you go. Let's just do one person. I don't want to smash our iron supply too much, so that's kind of what's going on here. All right, bricks are being made. We have a lot of laborers coming in. I think we're gonna need more food. And we're going to need more homes here very quickly. We've got glass. How much are you making? 49 glass. Fantastic. 72 bricks. Look at you making the new place better. And then building supplies. We're just going to we're going to start building those up. We're going to leave it alone. And that's going to be good. Okay. So food situation right over here. I think what we can do is uh, let's increase the amount of homes over here. Turn you guys around. I like the little pop outs, but let's wait and do it on the next one. There we go. Perfect. All right. We got a few of those. I think I'll put a couple of those three-story medieval houses, maybe by the building supplier or something. I'm not sure yet. Either way, I like them and I want to build a little bit more. Now, it is late winter, so I think I'm going to do soybeans. Let's also do tomatoes and then soybeans again. One, two, three. Tell these to be picked up by laborers so that they'll be super efficient. And then these, This is look at how well this is growing. Fantastic. And then we can actually upgrade this with building supplies. Basically, there's a ton of stuff that we could upgrade with building supplies that we're not doing right now. And uh, we, we could just improve life a little bit. I think that's what we're going for. I've only got one person working this. I could probably get two. Yeah, let's do two. Let's just get two people working this one. And uh, the stone production there is going to increase. And really what I'm going for, uh, the biggest thing that I found that's been pretty helpful are these specialized areas. So you need lumber and then you need building supplies. And they're just more efficient than doing a normal stockpile. And I need to be better about doing that earlier. Okay, what do you have for us? Um, I should probably have a little iron stockpile here or something, right? So let's see. Iron right right there. Just a four by. Four by four. Okay. And you're building up statues. Fantastic. What do we want to start getting? Let me think. The wool industry is going to slowly ramp up. Tools are okay. Um, oh, whoa, look at you. What, what's going on here? There's one guy. Oh, it, I remember this is pretty cyclical. So now he's in the cutting season. He's going to grow all the other ones. And I don't know. It's kind of weird. We could buy a ton of clay. We could buy, we could buy a lot of stuff in here. I don't really feel like we need 
most of this. We bought the logs. That's good. Homewares, I just don't feel like we need them. But I don't really want to send them off because I, I want to wait a little bit more time in between. So how efficient are you? You did. You've got 20-something so far in late spring. That's going to be great. And where's the smelter over here per year? 71. I think you're going to be more efficient, but it takes two people. This guy's only got one. I think there's some efficiency issues where this is like right next to it and it's just going to pop back and forth. But uh, I can't really confirm that right now. All right. So what did you guys all move in? Holy crap. Every single one of them did. Look at that. They're farming away. They're doing a fantastic job. We've got our supplier over here. I'm going to let this kind of reach a critical mass before I, I start building out a bunch of new stuff. So I think we're okay on that front. Let's check on the sand and clay. Clay is going down a little bit, but that's fine. Furnace fuel is staying about even, which I'm happy about. Um, sand, 42. We could do a little bit more sand. So let's let's actually do that. Let's get one more person working the sand. Work the sand pit. And something I don't normally do is the government stuff and like gold and taxes. Maybe we should do that. That might be kind of fun to mess with. So. Uh, I might amp that up here in a minute and, and see what's going on. Not sure yet. Look at all the stinking logs. It's because I'm... Uh, yeah. We really got to get these specialized stockpiles. I upped the limit on the logs. And actually, I think I'm kind of kicking myself in the bum by doing that. I'm, I'm clogging up a lot of industry. So why don't I actually get a couple people not working that? There's two. You, I want you to keep working. You're my little specialized guy. All right, what do you need? Oh, we need more. Yeah, we knew the llama was going to go down because uh, we split it off. Is this full yet? This is full and starting to actually make meat again. But this one... Wait, what the... Why do you only have two? What the heck happened? Get over here! What? Was there like a little plague that I didn't notice or something? Oh my gosh, that wasn't... That is weird! What happened? Huh, that's really incredibly confusing. All right, well, that's fun. Um, do we have do we have any big mines or anything? I don't think we can put mines there. I want to think about expanding. I want to, I want to expand really, really push hard. Um, maybe come out this way. Oh, this spot would be great for agriculture and all that good stuff. So why don't I do this? Let's start making a couple roads over here. Let's connect all this up. I'll put some stockpiles over here, and we'll just pull the raw resources and start preparing that way. Let's see, let's go like that. Got our shelves at Country Road over here. Uh, we just gonna go ahead and turn this up. Very nice. Just come up in here and build this right quick. Gonna make it nice and efficient and whatnot. Look at all them llamas just, you know, socializing and whatnot. All right, that works for me. Um, I do want nomads, so... Wait, wait. Are there no nomads here? <gasps> Okay, look, I'm really frustrated by the fact that the game is, like, not letting me have nomads. Oh, my gosh. Um, fine. Fine. You, not, fine. You know what? We're gonna have, no. 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 We can't, we can't even fit it in here. We're gonna fit it right over here. Look, these, these people. What do you have? What do you hear? Chicken soup? Chicken, onions, and carrots? Oh, you're not being worked, because I don't have any of that crap. All right, cool. Oh, that's right, we need chickens. Um, town hall is going to come right here by the soup kitchen, and that's where we're going to get all of our workers and whatnot. Let's put let's put a little bit of space in here, maybe one more. We're going to build that right there, and we're going to tear this thing down. You, you are a false, a false town hall that that did nothing for me. If you don't bring nomads and you don't do it right, you get destroyed. Those are the rules. All right, you understand? Like that's that you just can't mess with that. I get a little fired up. You mess with the nomad situation. Okay, small small town school. How you doing? You can only handle about 30, I think. I still think we're okay. I won't know until this is finished. <laughs> and actually, I don't know how much lumber we have. Considering how many logs we have right now, we could just turn this right back on. Start doing lumber. Fuel is looking fantastic. Furnace fuel, looking good. And um, how are we doing on production for marble? Wow, that's much better. Look at you go. Fantastic. And what else do we have? Can we, can we put anything else in here? I don't think so. We've got this maxed out, so Marble and Jade are going to come in here like crazy. Um, I would like to see the seedlings, but we need to let this finish. Hmm. We're doing some good stuff. We're doing some really good stuff. Let's go ahead and queue up, like I said, over here. I'll just, just remove all the things 
in this area. Just remove them all, all my workers and all my farmers. Look at them go. Holy crap, look at them go. I didn't even set up a stockpile. Wow. They're going to run all over the place. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Hold on. No. No speed. Oh, it's already done. Okay. No, it's not done. This thing. Do this thing. You'll you'll be happy. You'll run farther away. Oh, my gosh. They're all running back and forth. Wool coats on. Just freaking out. Look at that. I got 20 laborers. Oh, my goodness. I do want to check on the whole iron situation. It seems to be going up. Look at that. 113. Look at that. Give me another one. Somebody else worked the darn thing. Good job, you. Wow. Most of it's right there. Good job. All right. I'm pretty stoked about this. I think this is this is going well. Look at that. Nomad. See that little spot right there? We need that. Hello. Overview. Families and homes. Holy crap. We need, to, we need to increase that a lot. And we need to increase our food production as well. Wow. All right. Let's set out a few homes. I like this little area over here. This makes me happy. I don't know why. It just does. Don't don't make fun of Night Ghost. I'm actually going to jaunt this this way and go out here so we got some more room in front of the town hall. So let's do that real quick. Okay, these are two-story. They're going to be the shingled. Let's go with the inside corner. The inside corner. It's like sports center or something over here. What the heck? Uh, there we go. And we'll probably do two with... Actually, one. We'll do one um, with a pop-out. And then we will do a gate. Very good. And then we'll do one more, probably, right? And uh, we'll make sure that is with the pop-out, too. And then we'll do another turn. Now, I'm building a lot of homes, but we need them. I tell you what, Shetty. Back in the day, we didn't have homes. <laughs> Quiet, Grandpa. All right, so we're going to build up all of those. It's going to be fantastic. We're going to need food like crazy. So i got to start thinking about that, too. But that was the whole point of going this way. Some agricultural nonsense. We can build up too. Um, I keep spinning around like like a like a just crazy person. I need to calm down. It would be good if we got like wheat or oats, something that we can make flour with. So why don't we think ahead, get a trading post, and this time around, farm supplier, seeds and animals. I think that's gonna gonna serve us very well. Farm supplier, there you are. We got ourselves a little barn and a little stockpile. So don't you worry. We're gonna use you guys up real real quick okay look at how many laborers i have look at all the stinking laborers let's get another person working iron um i i want to know is this better 153 two people <laughs> so much better but i think that has like a limited kind of uh effectiveness right if you put too many people there they're going to harvest more than they're actually quote unquote growing or finding them 20s 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 holy cow Look at this overview. Look at that number. So much better now, but we need it to be a little bit more. Just a bit more. Uh, somebody died being crushed by a rock. Is there anything else we could build over here? I could probably do an apiary or, I don't know, something. Uh, medieval pond, probably don't need that. Smokery, drying shack. Wait. Oh, we could do smoked stuff. Aren't we already smoking something, though? Hold on. I thought we were. We are here. That's a butcher shop. That's different. Oh my gosh. Food Central. Get over here. Smoke shop. And then a drying drying shack. Yes. Do it. Build it all. We'll make even more food. Man, this is this has been this has been wild. This has been completely wild. I don't even know what to think anymore. What's going on here? Let's get a couple more people working this. What are we gonna trade? We're gonna trade uh freaking seedlings and coats. Because I don't have any other industry right now. Crap. Um where where are the seedlings? Uh, there we go. One, no, 500. We'll just do 500 and we'll do wool coats at uh, 200 because we don't want to kill that supply entirely. And there we go. We're going to do those and that should be enough to get us kind of started on a few things. Well, all right, guys. I think when we come back, we'll figure out this food. What's up with all this nonsense? We'll figure that out too. And uh, what we're going to do to move forward because um, the town's doing okay. It's not dead and we haven't had another tornado. Knock on lumber. Jeez, I don't want that to happen again. Thanks you, thank, thank you all for joining. Wow, the tongue tied. Uh, please like, favorite, all that good stuff. It just helps the series. Let's me know what you think. Leave some comments. See you guys next time. Later.